Hey y'all, welcome to Work It Wednesday. I am Cassie Bollinger. Tonight we're going to be going over Bring Back My Bar. Now this is a um, great time to start looking at how you're going to get sales in June. Um, our 2023 uh, June first release of the Bring Back My Bar is coming up very soon. Now, as a consultant, we got the early per uh, early perk to be able to get the bundles early, 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 early. <laughs> So that's an awesome thing that you can do for your customers is that you can either buy the full set and you can sample them out and send them out to your individual customers, um, either by asking them the top five or doing samples of every single bar and sending it out to them so they can smell them if they haven't been around long enough to, to smell some of these scents. So there's also a report that you can run. So we're going to kind of go over that tonight. Um, it's going to be a really quick little session tonight. Um, so I hope you enjoy it. I'm going to go ahead and minimize my screen for just a minute so I can pull up all the info. Actually, I think I did it this way. There we go. Um, so there is 20 different scents that are releasing on June 1st. On the Bring Back My Bars, um, these different scents have like or were selected in January. Um, every consultant or every customer was able to go on Cincy's website and choose their favorite bars. Now, we've had a selection. It's been out. There's even like different images that have been floating around um, through Facebook and through a lot of the different groups of the, all the scents and the smells. But how do you get your customers to look at them or know which ones they want? Um, the best way to do it is to contact the customers that maybe have already purchased these scents. And some of you may or may not know, there is a place on our workstation that allows you to look at which customers have purchased which scents prior. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and do a screen share here in just a minute. And I'm going to show you some of the workstation um, information. Um, I'm not going to do all of it. I'm going to kind of show you where to go. Um, because I don't want to show you guys my customer's information, um, but I'm going to go through there and I'm just going to kind of show you where you need to go. So let me go ahead and do my screen share. Here it is. Okay. So here is where you need to go. So this is going to be, I'm going to show you again, this is going to the dashboard going to reports and going under sales reports. So whenever you go into sales reports, there's going to be multiple options that you can select. Now, one thing that is generated is these promotions follow up. So you want to go in here because we want to look for the bring back my bar purchase history. So when you get to this point, you're going to do view. Um, at this point, what you're going to do is you're going to come over here and select all customer names. Now, if you were just looking for a certain scent of who purchased that one scent, you could do that individually, but you want to go through this search customers' names and select all. Um, I'm not going to do it because it's going to show you the list of my customers' names, and I don't want that actually out there. So let me go ahead and stop here. So with this report, what you're going to get is you're going to get the information of who, who purchased what day they purchased, how many they purchased, and what scent it was, and what year they purchased it in. So that way you can go back. Um, if it's a customer who's been with Cincy or buying from Cincy and has the same account, but maybe you're their new consultant, it could still show up. So you want to go through and you want to look at this report and you want to contact these customers. You want to say, hey, FYI, I saw that you had purchased this back a year ago, a couple of years ago. Um, and the scent is coming back out. Did you love it? Do you remember it? Um, if you're interested, let me know. And then that way you have multiple things you can talk to them about. One, about placing an order, um, setting up a rewards link or a shopping link. So that way they can put the order through on there. Um, the other thing is Scentsy Club. If they loved that scent, if they wanted that scent so much um, before and it like maybe it was discontinued, you can talk to them about starting your Scentsy Club. Um, tell them the different benefits of Scentsy Club. Bring Back My Bar is amazing. And this is where the time of the year, we have it two times a year that this, the Bring Back My Bars are voted on and two times a year they actually are released. So um, in July, we'll start voting on what comes out for the fall sets. So this is a great opportunity for you to talk to your customers, to explain to them what Cincy Club is and how they can continue getting those scents forever and ever. Amen. 
So take a moment and go through and look at the Cincy Club perks. If you do not have a Cincy Club already set up, that may be something you want to look into doing. Now you can go through and make a mock Cincy Club. Basically, as you go through and you do the selections, you kind of play around with it. This way, you know what the customers have to go through to get Cincy Club set up. And that way, when they ask you questions, you're like, I don't know, just pick what you can. You can actually kind of walk them through the steps of going to your website, clicking in the login, putting in the email address that they're receiving the emails from Cincy from, and then going back to that same location for account and dropping down into their Cincy Club and looking for updates for the subscription or maybe the reward points um, or the referral points. So that process and that concept of using that Cincy Club and then using the Bring Back My Bar to open that conversation of how it's useful for them. Now they get a whole month to decide if they want to add that stuff into their Cincy Club. So June 1st to June 30th, the Bring Back My Bars will be available to be added to Cincy Club. So again, this is a great time to go ahead and get ahead of the game before June 1st to ask your customers if they're wanting to purchase them or if they're wanting to get a Cincy Club set up so they always have that bar forever and ever, amen. So that reporting, again, is in your workstation. Um, whenever you go in and you log in, um, let's see, oops. Uh, when you log in uh, under your dashboard, you want to go under reporting, then you want to go under sales reports, and then you want to go and you want to select the promotional. Um, again, in that promotional, it is changing all the time. Um, currently right now, what's in this promotion is the bring back my bar purchase history or the bring back my bar leads. Now, what the leads part is, is for anybody who used your website to vote for these different scents. So that's another report that you can pull up. You can export them into an Excel spreadsheet. You can kind of pretty it up, get rid of the information you don't need and print it out. So that way you can go through the list and kind of talk about, talk to each one of your customers about their purchases. So I hope this was, um, I hope this was helpful. Uh, I hope you have a great success for the Bring Back My Bar that's coming out June 1st. If you have any other questions or if there's maybe something you want to know how to work through as a Cincy consultant, um, there's different features that our reporting tab has um, that are really great for new leaders or some leaders that maybe have never played with the reporting thing. Take a moment and kind of go through it and find out like the little things that maybe you didn't know about. So I hope, again, this was informative. If you have any questions, please make sure to comment below. And again, make sure that you like, share, or subscribe to this channel. Um, and if there's anything else that you would like training on or maybe something you're not quite sure or I didn't explain it uh, well enough for you to understand, let me know. I'll be more than happy to do another training again. I hope you guys have a great and amazing night. I love you all and I'll talk to you soon.